what's ready to ride Twins here in this video i'm going to be showing you the pet that will make you 100 times better in prodigy so let's go ahead and get right into it Alrighty guys, so like uh, like I said, I'm going to be showing you the pet that will make you 100 times better in Prodigy. So obviously I'm exaggerating a little bit when I say that, but I'm not joking when I say that this pet is the best pet in Prodigy and is going to at least make you better in Prodigy. And that pet is the Evolutus, or if you have a membership and choose to evolve it, it evolves into the Pedraxis. What is what, what is what I have? Now, let me explain to you why this pet will make you better in Prodigy. This is because this pet is virtually good against every element except Storm, which it itself is. Now, that's very important, and also, I made a video on how to catch this pet, um, so be sure to check that out. It should be popping up in the top right-hand corner of your screen right about now. Um, but the other good thing, or great thing I should say about this pet is because you can get it from bounties. Now, it, yeah, it's not on here right now. But you can get them from bounties. Uh, I remember when I got my Evolutus, I was level 88 and it was level like 89. So it's already a level higher than me. And as you can see, here it is. It says trait because that was its bounty name. Um, but here we go, trait level 100. At level 100, it's going to have 10,400 health, which means it's going to have a good bit of health, which means it can also give some hits and take some hits. And this is the real real reason why this is one of the best pets in Prodigy, and this is because of its spells. Alright, as you can see, it has Ion Cannon, which is a storm spell, Unlimited Power, which is a storm spell, um, which are good against water, which is uh, relatively important. And then Torrent, which is excellent right there, because um, you fire is one of the most commonly used pets in the game. And it's weak to water, which is why that this is probably one of the best spells on this pet, as well as Volcanon. Volcanon is probably, uh, other than Torrent, the most important spell on this pet. This is because it makes it powerful against ice, which it is weak to as a storm pet. As we can see, if we go ahead and check out its stats, if I can find it in the pet book, which I should be able to because it should be around uh, here. Yes, here we go. All right, so as you can see, Pedraxis, Evolution 2 of 2, or Evolutus if you don't have a membership, but their stats are the exact same. It doesn't change anything. As you can see, it has about, it's about 50-50, maybe 60-40. I'm going to get an exact uh, measurement on this, so I'll be right back. Already, so I was correct, it is going to be 5 to 5, which means it's not going to be doing a ton of damage, um, but you know what, that's okay, because it has that 10,400 health, and it's still going to be a decent amount of damage. It's not going to be like an Ember Shed or a Crook Fang amount of damage, but it's still going to be good. Uh, let's go ahead and hop into a battle uh, against some elements, and I'll show you guys just how powerful this pet really is. Alrighty, so here we are going up, up against a Trip Chop, which is a plant element pet, and one thing that I forgot to mention, I said it was good against ice, which is uh, important, but it also is good against plants, so it's good against fire, water, plant, and ice, which is insanely good. We're going to use Volcan and, and see if we can two-shot this Trip Chop right here. Um, we should be able to because it is going to be doing a fire spell. Now, the only downside to this is that it doesn't have an ice spell, and its attack animation is also amazing, and we can two-shot this Ivory, or just Trip Chop, excuse me. Um, the only downside to this pet is it doesn't have a spell that's good against its own element, which, you know, is okay. You, you don't really need a spell like that. It doesn't have an ice spell. Um, I would love it if it did. I would love it even more if it did, but since it doesn't, it kind of degrades it a bit, but it's still probably, in my opinion, obviously, the best pet in the game. And there we go, two-shotting that ivory trip chop right there. And uh, let's get into the next elemental battle. Alrighty guys, so here we are going up against a flick fit. We're going to use unlimited power because we should be able to two-shot these guys pretty easily right here. Um, we should be able to get these guys out with two area spells, none less, hopefully. Let's see what, 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 what oh my gosh, I'm stuttering so much. What we can do, there we go, 4100 damage when it's up, which is pretty good, which means we can two-shot this team in two area spells. So, um, yeah, with that aside, let's go ahead and get into the next elemental battle. 
And here we are going up against this Puck and Hob. Now, I'm not too concerned about the Hob, but here we go with Torrent. Like I said, we're going to be able to two-shot this because of that 10,400 health. Or, excuse me, because of that 5 to 5 ratio of power to hearts. Um, this pet is very useful in the Harmony Island Arena. Um, and in PvP battles as well, if, you wanna, if, you, if you're really OG player and you remember those. Um, but these are amazing in the arena okay um because of that health you only really need to put one heart rune on it which means it can take two hits from a wizard um which is excellent for a pet and you can put two damage runes on it which means it's going to be doing around six to seven thousand damage which is pretty good um we can go ahead and just battle this hob right here just as you can see 1900 damage against it it's going up against two elements right here none of which it is weak to or strong to so here we go let's take out this hob now as you can see it's only going to be doing about 2700 damage against an element that it's weak against which means that i mean it's still it's going to be able to take it out in three hits if it's within 6000 ish health and as you can see, it's staying alive right there. Um, I'm going to answer this yes, it better be right. There we go, we got it correct. <laughs> um, Alright, so as you can see, it takes out this hop and the puck with ease. A dual match right there, and that is Quadraxis. Let's move on to the ice element, which is going to be a real test for this pet because it is weak against ice element. Alright, here we are against this Ruckus, and remember when I said it has that Volcanic, which makes it strong against an additional two elements? Yeah, we're going to be using that against an element that is weak to. Doing damage in an Ice Pet, or any pet that you're weak to, is critical. And I- oh, what- what good timing right there. A critical in my sentence and a critical hit. But, um, no, doing damage to a pet that you're weak to and being able to take it out in a reasonable amount of hits is very important when it comes to PvP battles, arena battles, or anything of that sort. Now, obviously, Draftus can do this because it has that Volcanon spell. And, um, let's just take a quick recap of why this is, in my opinion, the best pet in Prodigy and and will make you a lot better in Prodigy. Alright, so to recap why this is, in my opinion, the best pet in Prodigy, it has very good spells, it's good against every element except Storm, um, and it's, its heart to health ratio is even, which means it can take some hits while giving some hits, and also it looks cool, like you can't doubt that it looks cool. It's a snake, and when it attacks, it has wings on it. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and subscribe. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you on the flip-flop.